Hey, I'm Chantastic. This is React Holiday, day 24. Today we're talking about code splitting. Now you'll notice that I've done quite a bit of work here to modularize all of the things that we had uh, in this index file. Uh, you can explore this on your own time. The most important thing is that I've now put this Pokemon uh, component in its own file. Now that allows us to import it on its own. Now, the reason that's important is because code splitting happens on component boundaries. So we want to import a component dynamically. Uh, we need to have it in its own file. So to do that, to change from a static import to a dynamic import, we just change a few things. Uh, first, we're gonna do an assignment, const Pokemon, uh, put our import over here and uh, wrap that up in parens, this is the dynamic syntax. And we need to tell React what the heck's going on here. So we'll use react.lazy to do the communication work between the import promise and uh, what that means for React. So that takes a function, so we'll give that there, and boom, we're done. We see a little bit of an error here, and that's just saying that all of our imports need to be together at the top of the file. So just switch the order there and you're good to go. So now we're importing our component dynamically, which is pretty sweet. Uh, let's see what happens. Breakage, that's not good. Now, the reason we're seeing this is because anything that's imported dynamically may happen on a delay. So it might not happen right away because we don't have the code right away. And while we're waiting, what do we show to the user? That's what the suspense component comes in with a fallback. So we're gonna find our component, uh, do what the error tells us to do to render suspense around it. So react.suspense, top and tail, and we'll give it some kind of fallback. So we'll say, hey, while we're waiting, uh, just render something like loading. We can put a component in here, whatever you want. Now, when we do this, everything works like a charm, and we're dynamically importing this uh, Pokemon component. We only pull this component from the internet where we use it, which is really, really nifty.